All right, if you're a parent, there's always been a couple of things you bought your children that you kind of regretted buying, and this is one of them. When I saw this style Tonka truck, I just I gravitated to it because of the tires, how aggressive they look, and how they stick a little bit out from under the fenders. The look of the pickup just looked really good to me, and I bought my son this fire rescue truck and another uh, Tonka truck in the same manner. I think it was a construction truck. When I bought it for him, I got I gave it, gave it to him for Christmas, and this is something from hmm, I'd have to say mid '90s. He loved this thing, and the reason why he loved this thing is because you fill the back of it up with water, and it would squirt. That was a problem because he was constantly filling it up in the house and squirting everything. So it never went outside, but he played with it a lot it doesn't show hardly any play wear at all uh, the paint is awesome on it and if I fill it with water today it would still squirt water all right here's the front of the truck and on the hood it's got a decal it says fire rescue Tonka number seven dial 911 now what I'm not too crazy about is how the metal came together here when they formed it the decal has got a lift here because it doesn't fit flat. I'm worried about the decal lifting in the future. Alright, here's the curbside. And the decal here also has a lift. I don't know if you can see it that good, but uh, it's not going to show up. But it has a lift there. And it's not because of it being outside or being abused. It's just how the decal was applied. This shot, I just want to show you how good looking those tires are. Aggressive mud grips. That's, like I said, when I bought this truck and the other pickup, that's what drew me to it, was those aggressive mud grips. All right, here's a shot of the back. The tailgate on this one does not open and close, but this is the compartment that you put the water in. That's, your wa that's where you fill it here. You charge it here. And then when you wanted to squirt the water, you push down that square button and it would shoot a stream of water and you could turn the cannon whichever direction you wanted to turn it. Oh yeah, same uh, deal with the decal on this side, on the uh, driver's side as on the passenger side. It has a lift right here. That's, it, that, that's just how it was applied. All right, there's a shot of the bottom. There's no dates on it. I wish I could remember the year I bought it, but I, I don't. Now, like I said, when I gave it to him for Christmas, I I bought him a whole bunch of Tonkas and Nylants and other cars and trucks for Christmas and throughout the years. But this was had to be one of his most favorite ones. I posted video of a Nylant ladder truck. Uh, the green one I can't remember the color green what it's called save my life I figured he'd love that but this was always his favorite to play with it's got a hole in the roof that I guess to access with an action figure but this truck did not come with one that I recall I don't think it did but that's it for this video on this Tonka truck Tonka fire and rescue from the mid 90s awesome condition he will, every time I move any of his trucks around that aren't packed up, he thinks I'm going to sell them and he gets panicky. So when I post videos or when I make a video of any of his trucks, I do it when he's not here. So apparently he's not home. All right, guys, thanks for viewing. You guys have a wonderful afternoon.